Good evening, folks. Welcome to the stream. I hope you're all having a fantastic week so far. Hope you are all enjoying yourself. We're going to be playing some more Baldur's Gate tonight. We've already got Sparks in the chat. We're just waiting on Bard as well. But uh, let's go say hi, shall we? And see what kind of shenanigunery we get up to this week. Hola, senor. Hey, hey. How's it going, mate? You're right. Yeah, not bad. My food just arrived, so I'm just going to start firing into that. Fair enough. Apologies that uh, we started that little bit early. It's all right. I ended up not going to the gym anyway. Oh, fair enough then. A bit late, so I wasn't going to make it there and back. Nah. Uh, it's really cold out there. Yeah, it is fucking freezing. I have been wearing like my t-shirt, a jumper, and the Pokemon Udi that uh, Jess got me for Christmas the entire day, practically. So... Yeah, I haven't taken my hoodie off the whole day, and that is incredibly rare. I went to the office in a jumper yesterday. That's just wrong. <laughs> Was it one of those posh jumpers, though, where it, like you've got the shirt underneath it and you look all posh and stuff? Oh, yeah, it was the whole look. Ah, oh, okay. See, because I've, I've got a jumper uh, back at my parents' place that I really should bring back home at some point, but it's one of those where it looks like it's got a shirt underneath, but it's quite literally just around the collar. Let's go, Moochie. Mochi. Mochi. Whatever. I can read it, I promise. <laughs> it has indeed been a while since I have seen yourself. How are we? I hope you're doing well. I hope you're doing good. Right. Let's get loaded in. We're just waiting on bot at the minute, so. Jump back in your chat bags and leaving. No, 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 don't do that. I, I I just can't apparently read tonight, that's all. It's not your fault, it's nothing to do with you, it's me, okay? I'm the problem. Hey, up. Hey, bud. I, I believe Sparks is probably uh, self-muted, just eating some foods and stuff, so... Oh, I'm on push talk anyway, mate. <laughs> oh, okay, fair enough. Okay, right, let me get you invited. Oh my god, Moji, the puns are happening today, apparently. I don't agree with them, but they're at least happening. It's not a boulder that's in the way, it's a, just a bunch of bald people. Bald gnomes, lots of them. Okay, um, so... Just for a bit of info for yourselves, I did do a bit of exploring off the stream. Not much. I haven't, you know, gone down to fucking Moonrise Towers and just murdered everything. Um, I mostly just uh, went around the right side, the House of Healing, um, and just above the Mason Guild. Um, and then also up towards the entrance for the Mountain Pass. Okay. Now, there is a guy... Can I ping the map? No, I can just place a custom marker. Uh, I don't know if you see my custom marker. Um, it's just below the camp in the Shadow Curse lands. I'm not yep. in the game yet, so. Ah, fair enough. That's it. Yep. It's um, this guy. Oh, that, that guy. Yes, I, we haven't spoken to that guy yet because obviously we just hadn't actually gone up that way yet. But I've I've done all of that. I didn't get in any fights or anything. So, um, although there was one fight I did end up getting to after doing my little respec into my machine gun, um, Eldritch Blast, wasn't keen on it by the way. Um, so I know that there is a fight up there that we could do. It's just a bunch of ravens at well, like one HP. Not all that fussed about it. It's not a lot of XP. Um, but yes, there is a guy like right there that we haven't spoken to yet, which we probably could do, so. Jess informs me he hands us another quest. Uh, 
is true. So I'm going to go teleport over to Last Light Inn. So that we can make our way over. Uh, do we not just want to everything. teleport to camp in Shadow Curse Lands? Is that not a, a teleport? It's not a teleport, no, unfortunately. Oh. Or at least if there is one, I didn't see it, so... Okay. We are all here. Yeah, I think we actually come across the raven right here. Right, would we like to do this fight? We don't have to. Ah, uh, why not? Right, touching the raven. As I say, it's just a bunch of them that don't really do a whole lot, so... So what it is, is some easy XP. Yeah, they're 40 yeah, XP a, a, this is worthwhile. To be fair, I, I didn't actually realise it was that much at first, so yeah. I don't think they can do a whole lot of damage either, so... Watch them crit your face off now. <laughs> nope, they're all they're all trying and all missing. Oh, there's a group up there as well. Ow. <laughs> right then. Uh, I think we're surrounded. <laughs> I mean, I could just... Do I want to blow a level 3 spell just killing them all in one go? It seems wasteful. It does seem wasteful, doesn't it? It, it does indeed seem wasteful. There we go. Yep. <laughs> I just wanted to take the opportunity to taunt something to death for a change. <laughs> Alright, if I remember correctly as well, they have absolutely nothing on them, so. Right. I'm a bit busy We'll talk later. Did someone just click on me? Yeah, I was trying to do a lay on hands on you. Oh, uh, okay. Try not to go storming off too far either. Every time I try and heal you, you fuck off. I won't heal you. <laughs> no heals you. Sorry. I'll wait. No, that's it. There <laughs> ah yes, Gloomy Dave. Yes. <laughs> this is name. Where lies your guilt? The waning moon. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. What's going on here, then? <laughs> you walk in the darkness unafraid. How curious. This guy is Fair such point. an edgelord. Perhaps mm -hmm. this one could assist us. The murdered lie silent. The raven asks, will you be their voice? What does the raven want to know? He thinks you strong enough for the task at hand. This woman tended a bar where she took her patrons, her friends, 
into her confidence. Promised their secrets were safe with her. Yet she turned their words into knives and stabbed them in the back. Ooh. They died because of her. And to this day, her victims lie unavenged. <laughs> She's dead. How much more can she be? You see it as I do. I seek a record of this one's crimes, written in her own hand. Through it, I can summon her spirit and force her to face trial for her crimes. Okay. Oh, yes. Show me. Such spells are ancient secrets and closely guarded. But I could be to share them with an ally. Hell yes. <laughs> Your soul sparks with justice, with fortitude. This is your chance to bring a murderer to justice, to avenge her victims. Will you take it? <laughs> so long as I get paid. <laughs> the death of heroism is close, I see. Go to the distillery, the one she calls the waning moon. Find the ledger and bring it to me. Okay, then. Always room for more. I mean, if you're not using the silver. <laughs> Well, I didn't get to loot around here before because I didn't want to talk to him without you guys. <laughs> okay. So. We have a multitude of quests all around that area now. Um, all around the southern side of uh, Wraithwin. Shall we teleport there and make our way around? Where are from? Right, we've got nothing for the toll house at the moment. Uh... Oh, come on, it's right there. <laughs> Was it still <laughs> saying you couldn't? Uh, no, I mean, the, the toll house is like right here. We might yep. as well explore it while we're here. Oh, I'm, I, I am all down for the loot goblin, and you know this. <laughs> Let's have a look. If I can't loot goblin, I'm not happy. <laughs> Help wanted. That's our square house. And merchants wanted. Sail the silvery seas. Gaze upon the gate. No experience required. Hmm. Or in fact desired. Hired goons. The fuck is that? A visage of obedience. <laughs> should speak up. I'm gonna go talk to the floating skull. Report to the toll master. Uh, the toll. Which never goes badly, right? Silks from Comir, it says. Report to the toll yes. master. What? All the way from Thay. Jewels and gems, probably. Also here. Might as well open the doors. Right, I'll do proper loot goblin in later. I'll just wait for you before I go upstairs, actually. <laughs> Didn't know if another was an upstairs. I mean, just about. Me. Okay, there's definitely. Oh, what's he done? I still could. Nothing. Oh, I found another skull. <laughs> I like the skulls. They're helpful. Uh, it's not your. It's not your job to talk to things. I mean, I. True, but still, <laughs> they're not exactly important it's, NPCs. So. True. It's definitely. It's definitely they're, I'm sure they're important to themselves and their families. 
Oh, I didn't see these stairs here. That's why. Okay. Oh, why is there a trail of gold? <laughs> it's as if someone saw you coming and, let, and set a trap, isn't it? <laughs> it really is, especially for me. <laughs> it's like, ooh, shinies. Mm -hmm. Out of sight. Out of Damn it. Mind. I can't sneak. What the f... Geron got Thorm. Well, gold, 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 gold. Ah! Mine! What do you bring? I bring wine? Some good voice acting on that one. You can pass, but first you must stay. Oh, this is one where you got to give them like five thousand pieces, and you'll get something in return. And then you just kill them to get your money back. Hmm. Hmm. Um, nom nom nom. See, this is your final form. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is mine. Um. If I give it all the gold that I have, can we then kill it? But it's also not all of my gold because I've got some of it. Ah, okay. Oh, it's just all the gold that I have, correct? Yeah. I think. I think. Ah, do I, it. I, I, What's the worst that can happen? We go horribly wrong and we reload. Really fair point. I give it all my gold and then we kill it. Because I want my gold back. Um, nom nom nom. Yes. Signed trade visa. There we go. How often can I use that though? Single use. God damn. Okay. What does it do? Uh, so, sign trade visa. A visa promising safe passage to Baldur's Gate, stamped with the letters G T. Um, however, it allows me to cast a spell that basically allows me to transform whatever I touch into gold. Okay. Hold on a minute. Okay, what are we doing? Seems like a good moment to talk. <laughs> failing, failing miserably. Oh, I haven't got an action. Uh, I don't. If everyone could just end their turn, so I get to the next turn. That'd be great. All right. What now? Are you just trying to rob it? <laughs> ah, it was worth a try. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, there we go. God damn it. <laughs> Holy yep. shit. Yep. Yowzers. Yeah, um...
Well then. Um. Trying to get into a good position. Come on. Twenty five percent chance to hit with six hundred and six health. Yeah, do an examine and you'll see what the uh, what the score is. Conditions coin helmet. Cursed coins have gathered around the toll collector's head, increasing her overall health. Oh my god. Yeah, look at the coin armor feature. Curse coins are uh, allowing her to use them as whips and increasing her overall health. Jesus, man. 16 AC. Okay. I do like the fact that I got hit with a single attack and it got 146 damage. Yep. <laughs> Absolutely bull. God damn it. Oh, I took 740 damage. Noise. Which didn't put me down. <laughs> yeah, you took a second hit, didn't you? Yep. Yeah, no, Max was hit for 168 and downed. Bod healed for one HP. I don't know how much damage you actually took before being downed. Doesn't actually say. No, it was 760 or something. Oh, I, I mean, that yeah, on, on the, on the it was a number, a number 67 or greater, which is the yeah. key thing. Uh, Bodrick was hit with seven, for 740 damage. Damn. 740 damage. All right. Okay. Let's see what the hell happens here. Yeah. Maybe I should have reload. Maybe I should have saved before we uh, did this. <laughs> eh, we're not too far back. Yeah, jealous avarice is the attack that Bod got hit by. Seizing on greed, the toll collector damages the character based on how much gold they're carrying. Oh wow. Oh. <laughs> okay, so I'm not going to get hit for that much. Right. <laughs> uh, yeah, you're not. Uh, um... <laughs> yeah, you might. I'm already dead. Nah. Ah, Haha. Breathe deep and move. But feel feel free to uh, throw potions at us or something. Yeah, you make a fair point actually. Uh Bro. Do I have any potions? Yes, yes I do. Path interrupted? Path interrupted, I can't. Or at least not with this character anyway. I shall do it in a moment.
Apparently it's a 4% chance. Eh, uh, you're just close enough to splash, it'll be fine. Alright, I can't get the both of you with one, unfortunately, so... Uh, well, we, we can both heal, so... There you go. I threw medium at you. Yay. Yay. <laughs> That's my turn. Apparently they lugged the roof. Ow. How did I just get hit by? Oh, there, there we, we go. go. <laughs> Took long enough. <laughs> Why do they all lock the roof? But the barbarian with the big sword can't get them. Fair point, I suppose, yeah. Bye. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Ow. There we go. Oh, nearly. <laughs> Pass my death save. There you go. I, I still can't get bored from this angle, but there you go. Thank you, that got me up too. Yeah, that's better. Well, let's see if we survive this round. We will not. No. <laughs> no chance. Now, was not expecting it to have that much HP. Oh yeah, it's it, it, it's serious unless you unless you do the gimmick. That's a gimmick. Yeah, I say it's a basic. That's what I was trying to do. Because I I I examined it and yeah okay I fought it before but I did go through the through the steps examined it saw it's got loads of coin armor so I thought I'll take all its coins off it. Ah uh, okay makes sense. But that makes sense. You can't split people's purses down in their pocket and you'd given it so much gold that it was a DC twenty two pickpocket check. <laughs> Ooh <laughs> okay. Well, I, I can't actually do anything, so... Enter. And now we die. Yes. Hello. Oh, Ooh, I've got one hit left. Bot didn't take any damage. This will be the end of my one hit. There we go. Yep. Bot still taking no damage. Oh, perhaps some sort of necrotic resistance. Ah, there nuts. you go. <laughs> yeah, that's two failed death saves for me because they just blasted me. Oh, I'm so fucking dead. Ow. Blast it back. Eh, fuck it, why not? Fuck you. Because if you're getting loads of, loads of action. Yeah, right? I know. Two HP. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's my death save. Hey, <laughs> girl.
I mean, we've took off nearly nearly 100 HP from it. Oh, what? Yeah, so I took his left band brace off by killing one of the visages. Oh. Okay, then. If I'd have known that a bit sooner as well. <laughs> I imagine we're probably redoing this fight, but yeah, it's a fight I wanted you to walk blind into, so you got the reaction, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I wish you, to be fair, I wish you'd have told me to hold off on the reaction then, because I'd have at least could have then done a Scorching Ray on fucking all of them. Eh, don't worry about it. Like, like I say, we're, we're not getting through this fight in one piece in the state we're in. I'll be, I'll be incredibly impressed if we do it anyway. Well, There's another one. Grunge, everything is possible, so jot that down. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if I manage to get an action one round... No. No. <laughs> yeah, because I can absolutely ruin all of this lot, but I'm not doing now, so... Yeah, you're just up, down, up, down, up, down. Like a bar's knickers. No comment. <laughs> Will you stop it? No. Charmed. Uh-oh. Something tells me I don't want to be in that. <laughs> what was your first clue? <laughs> the explosive name. I must, I must heal. It's not a lot, but it's something. Blood comes easy these days. Oh, I'm backing out of that. Path interrupted. Path interrupted. Path interrupted. Shit, I can't hit these. Look how much um, the keeper's hit points have come down now. Yeah, I know. 306 now. Are these schools weak to anything in particular? Uh, week to psychic. Can resist this necrotic. Oh, they're undead. Lovely. Okay, I can't do any psychic damage with that, but I can try and do something else. Uh, problem is, I can't seem to aim up on the roof, and that's where I want to aim. Sorry, right. they, yeah, don't worry about it. Just put damage on the big guy. Okay. In that case, then, does he have any weaknesses? I don't think so. No nope. resistances. No, okay. Oh, I like fire, so. Oh, I thought I was going to do more damage than that. Oh, well, he's on fire. Nice. It's lovely spacing. I've stood at the bottom of this ladder for good reason. <laughs> Ow! Excuse you? Come to get rid of this last visage? What did I get that inspiration for? Uh, we all got it. It's one of the toll collector by removing all of her gold armor. Oh, there we go. Six HP. Uh, okay, all right. In which I case, then, let, let, let me go smack it one. Oh, I missed it. Perhaps 
Now give it a minute. There we go. All right. Thank you for having my gold back. <laughs> right. I got a weapon from it. Twist of Fortune. When you roll two or less with this weapon's damage die, re-roll it and take a new take the new result. Hmm. Yeah. It's only one to eight damage though. It's not exactly a lot, but. Yeah, but if it's a dagger. It's not. It's a it's a mace. Oh right. Well, a morning star, sorry. So I will give it to our good friend, not Legolas. Because he is a pack mule. Well, and plus you can use a mace at least. I mean, it's not optimal, but still. Right, he, he ha it had a key for something as well, I think. Yeah, that would be the thing that Bod wrenched open earlier. Ah, okay. <laughs> Keys for. Who needs those things? Where we're going, Something we don't need here. keys. I hope. I take it we've uh, picked up all of the gold on the floor. Breathe deep and move. On the floor, yeah. Somebody with perception, come up this ladder, would you? Uh. Because apparently, because I've only got one eye, I can't see the fact that this ceiling's absolutely fucked. Thank you! The ceiling's fucked, mate. <laughs> you might not want to step on that. There you go. There you go. Yeah. I mean, if you'd have waited. Nah. Y your issue's more how are you getting out of there? Uh, yeah, I, that's that's why I didn't piss about with them. Um, because I can get out. Heavy chest. I do like a nice heavy chest. Hey. Uh, right. Can I interest anyone in a great axe plus one? Uh, probably the barbarian. When you, whenever you take fire damage dealt by another creature, you gain two turns of heat. That would be good for Karlak. That would be. But we don't have call. Well, we don't. Bet that will fit in my pack. Here we go. Got a locked safe over here. Sure, I did some. Uh... Oh, yeah, there it is. Hmm. Alright, coming back into the toll house. I've got some locked doors in the toll house still. Yeah. Ooh, managed to fail a DC 14. Bloody hell. Shame. <laughs> Shame. Use one of my thieves' tools. Where was this locked safe? Right, out the back. Um, up Upstairs. Ah, yeah, it's on the kind of a balcony. That's what it looks like. It's out the back. I'm lighting up all the lanterns just because. Oh, 
That was a waste of a perfectly good crit. Oh, wow. I might have these. Or actually, this might be a bod one. It'll be me or they. Uh, Battle Mage's power. When a weapon attack roll inflicts a condition, the wielder gains arcane acuity and plus one to strength saves. Right. Um, I have a very good chance of uh, doing the chill status on weapon hits. Uh, what statuses am I doing? I'm not really, but what do my smites do? No statuses on that. Uh, no, I'm doing a bunch more damage. No, yes, yeah, so I think they're probably best on you. On the other hand, I want to stick with the gloves I've got, which um, put um, yet another condition on things that I do cull damage to. Cool. Right, well, I'll hang on to them. Oh, wait, hang on. No, it doesn't apply the burn. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I'm not applying much in the wave. Oh, wait, no, I can just chuck arrows. I could do arrows that do statuses. Yes. Of which I have very few. Many. No, very oh. few. Someone's been pinching uh... the arrows. Would you log some monkers? Uh, I'm pretty sure I've got plenty. That, that might be why I've not got any. Yeah. Oh, I uh, haven't been taking I... them off yet. Yeah. It's just that uh, yeah. I, I, you know, loot goblin, so I pick up shit. Yeah. So. As soon as I'm, you know, chucking arrows about the place, it would be uh, handy. Yeah, not a problem then. Bear with me. Whoops. Press caps lock rather than shift. Uh, there you go. You get oh. a whole set of them. Hopefully that should have uh, tied you over a bit. Yeah, unfortunately, um, it looks like the arrows don't really do much in the way of statuses. Oh, uh, as an FYI as well, I did also manage to find a Night Orchid. I gave that a shot of hot. Cool. Just, just as a, you know, gift. Yeah. So I'm probably not wearing them anyway, um, because I've just not got any ways of doing statuses. Where was this uh, chest you wanted me to unlock? Right where I am. Right up. It's open. Yep, just turn your right. Oh! Oh, the... <laughs> The safe door. I, I, I. Perception Perception failed there. many. Oh my god, that's DC thirty. Right, break out the buffs, boys. Right. No, where, where the fuck is game? No, stop, stop taking me <laughs> places. And I wanted to see the roof earlier, but not right now. Although, actually. Can I actually get into that? Oh, there's a backpack up here. In fact, has someone not got the key for his safes? Uh, I did pick stuff up off him. No, it's locked. Okay. Do you want, do you want, uh, yeah. Right, Because it okay. should just auto-pocket it, shouldn't it? Yeah, it should quick pocket it. Uh, right, Although I have just picked up a Toll House basement key. Doesn't sound right. Uh, no, I don't think so. Open up. I mean, Nat went is an automatic success, right? Yeah. Um. Right. What have I got that will buff things? I was gonna say, really, the only buff that we have is like guidance, I think. Yeah, because I'm the one that also dishes out the buffs, which is irritating. Okay, here we go. Right, yeah, I so I'm not standing next to this trap. <laughs> uh, well, yeah. Uh, right, so it's a 9 to 12 bonus that I've got. So I've got a good chance. Oh, no, I've got a shit chance, but... <laughs> right, I'm, 
gonna go see if I can find this basement while you guys are working on that. I'm just gonna use an inspiration because we've got four, so we're maxed out. But you should use all the inspirations because there's bound to be something awesome in here since it's so difficult to get into, right? Well, I can re-roll with thieves' tools, you see. Uh, oh, right, yeah, cool. 18, maybe. 28! Oh, come out. Sixteen, that's unlikely. Yeah, that doesn't get it. Oh, fuck awful. I was gonna say I'm I'm seeing it before even you do, I think. Twenty nine. Yay! That's looking good. There you go. You yes, got it. Yeah, yeah. I was going to say, we can see, like, even before you do, failed or succeeded. There's a skeleton and some water and a skull and a pouch <laughs> with a gold ring, a camp supply pack, some rotten cheese and some rotten eggs. <laughs> Woohoo. <laughs> really? Is that it? Well, so what's uh, the loot like in the basement? I don't know. I haven't found it yet. I can't oh, see right. any stairs down or anything. So, and the only door that I, the only door that I can find that might be it. Oh, for fuck's sake! Fucking pathing on this because it keeps finding, finding shit. Well, I'm going to open these double doors that I lock picked earlier. Forget it. It's yeah. blocked from behind. Just says it's blocked from behind, and I think that leads into the basement. But oh, there's a room directly above that one, and I'm sure that that floor is absolutely fine. <laughs> yeah, that's all fine. There's no problems here. Forget it. It's blocked from behind. Uh, I've got a druid shield that I've pinched out of a chest. What? All right, before we jump down, there you go, just in case. Oh, I didn't realize Feather Fall was a, a mass buff. Uh, mine is. There's a button. Which leads outside but does nothing. Uh, it's the way out. Ah. Bunch of clothes. Which I'll just sell later on. Oh, I found the basement entrance. Oh. Uh huh. Right. And then, is there anything fun down here? Doesn't look it. Um, I just got a failed perception. I passed this. Uh, oh, 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 <laughs> Finally. Moving ahead. Shouldn't have wished to live in more 
interesting. Okay, that secret door's cool as fuck. Woo. Loot, 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 looty, loot, loot, loot. Oh boy, I'm encumbered. <laughs> I wonder why. Does one cast Featherfall? Oh no, there's roots. Uh, I can do if you want me to. No, that's fine, we've got, we've got roots. My, this doesn't feel like a trap. This is surprisingly dull. Yeah. After all that. Anything of use? We we got the gilded chest and a rustic chest. Yeah, free loot and some bloody yeah. tutorial sandals. I mean, to be fair, I have literally steal, stolen all of the clothes and just sent it all to the camp, just to sell later. I mean. It's not as if they go for much. Although it did no. mean at one point that I had some shoes in my inventory to throw at someone when I couldn't make another attack. That was good. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I, guess, I think that's how I started that fight against the zombies. I threw some shoes at them. Yeah, that all just feels surprisingly not eventful. Here goes nothing. Okay, so that's the toll house. Completely ransacked. Yup. Shall we go to the pub now? Yeah, I'm... Uh, pub I'm is over at the Waning Moon, right? Yeah, I'm down for that. <laughs> I mean, you might want to save before we go in, just saying. Okay, <laughs> saving, there we go. Yeah, you never know what's going to happen when you get the pub. <laughs> I mean, text... yeah, true, true. Yeah. What's a roofer's favorite kind of magic? I can feel Ceiling close. magic. Okay. I can feel it. We're close. Okay. I can feel it. I wonder if we can feel it. The absolute. His power is strong here. Oh, we're at Moonrise Towers. Uh, uh, yeah, but if we run just across the front, we'll get a teleport location on that. That's all right. Dig. Dig, 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 dig. Eh, copper band, wire arrow, which I will now send to Max, and some money. Ooh. Big door toilet. There's the waypoint. Okay, can confirm. Nothing fun in the outdoor toilet. What were you expecting? A glory hole or something? I mean, not sure that works on an, out on an outdoor toilet. <laughs> I, I, I'm not sure that, work, that works on a gnome type. <laughs> Hello, I seek glory. Seek glory. <laughs> glory to you and your house. To you and your hole. Whilst it would be incredibly traditional for me to be the first one through the doors and down the, down the stairs to the bar, I think the people who haven't done this encounter before should do that. <laughs> oh, he's a big guy. And yes, 288 uh... health. Okay, right. And saving once more just in case. Would we like a short rest just in case? I mean, we've, we've, we've just recently had a short rest, so... Yes, but I'm more thinking health. Meh. It's fine. Okay. What the... 
It gets okay. you every time, doesn't it? Yep. <laughs> Look at you up on God. that stool like a normal yep. sized person. God, it just reminds me of uh, the old World of Warcraft boss. You want drink a great that mug. Drink the mug. Drink the mug. Drink the mug. Come on. It's glowing blue. <laughs> <laughs> I am not close. trusting this. <laughs> oh. You wanted to come to the pub. I did. <laughs> well then. Yeah. Let's see what you've done now. Yeah, but my assassin managed to drink him to death. I mean, we can reload and I can try that, but... Nah, you'll just die. You will, you will. Yeah, I don't think you've got much of a capacity somehow. <laughs> right, what we got? Um, so it's immune to thunder, bod. Immune. Oh, yeah. Well, that sucks. Do you want to do a lightning combo? Oh, wait, no, we can't do a lightning combo because I'm before you. And, and he's immune to thunder damage. Uh, yeah, but thunder and lightning are two different things. Oh, it's because he's numb, that's why. It's... What what have we told the barbarian about firing his bow? You make a fair point, yeah. Uh... <laughs> hmm. Oh, it's immune to slashing damage. Fucking hell! That was fairly troubling. Yeah, he. If I remember correctly, his. Um, Slashing, piercing, bludgeoning, and thunder damage. This is variable, depending. I love the way we've got the um, the gnome warlock out the front. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Well, I don't have the slots for another mass cure, so cunning plan's gonna have. So we're all never immune to fire damage. Well, that puts my scorching rain fireball out of fucking use. He's not got any resistances to necrotic damage, does he? Oh, okay. Tempted to just cast Floyd on him then. Can't even catch my breath. Can't target undead with Floyd. God damn it. Okay then.
So the barbarian can't exactly do much, sadly. <laughs> Profoundly intoxicated. <laughs> right, it's not resistant to fire damage anymore. Uh, uh yeah, because I killed the imp. Oh, okay. Would we like a maybe a hunger of hater on him? Uh you'll have a I mean, can you do a hunger of hadar without blocking him off to melee? Oh shit, I just clicked on accident. I mean, technically, we can see inside anyway, so I think. You might just need to move out of that, Max, because I, I, I don't know if I got you in on there on accident. I, I think you might have. And I apologize, I accidentally clicked. I was trying to search around for an area where I could get him and the zombie, but not you. Oh no, I'm not in it. Oh, woo! Okay, I did good. <laughs> I'll just make doubly sure, mind you. I mean, I'm, I'm quite literally just doing two acid damage to him every time with a barbarian. Uh, Have you not got a magic weapon on it? No, unfortunately. It's just a... Well, I mean, it, it's a Soulbreaker greatsword. Yeah, it's, no, magic, yeah he's, he's immune to all... Slashing damage. Slashing, piercing. It's not just non-magic. Oh, shit. Let's go for this. Okay, I got the stun. I mean, it, it'll do. Yeah, it's plus it's weapon enchantment plus one, so yeah. Oh, he's stunned. Yep. I mean, if you can drench him, bod, I can um, hit him with a, a lightning rune. That's like a plan. Well, before you do that, do you want me to scorch and ray him so that you know? Yeah, do I'm that not first. melting shit on him. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Oof! Nice. Okay, that's my turn done. Feel free. Yeah, and you might want to have the Barbarian step back after his attacks this round. Okay. Right, he is now wet. Yeah. So you say moving back after your attacks, yes? After your attacks, yeah. Again, it's not much, but it's something. Right, I don't know how far back that you want him, so I'm just going to put him here. I'll do. Nice. One, one fifteen. 
16 damage from the Hunger of Hydar, man. God damn. Yeah, because it does cal damage, doesn't it? So it's getting doubled. Mm -hmm. Don't want to push him on this one. But it still did. Even though I had it turned off. I still am no longer, it's fine. Hey, 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 stay away. Eh, it's fine. Unless it doesn't cost you anything, but that's up to you. No, it costs you a part of inspiration, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm pretty yes. sure we're having a long rest after this, though. I was going to say, it's fine. I, I've got the health available. I've got 38 HP, so I'm okay. You're good. Sorry, I was just uh, checking my messages. Sorry? Right. Well, I'll tell you what, since the Barbarian isn't doing... Fuck off. Isn't doing a whole lot to the main boss. Let's have him smack some of these guys, shall we? Hello. Uh, you're in the Hunger of Hadar there, by the way. So, when you're done, you might want to back out. There you go. Okay. Thanks for the warning. Welcome. Oh, come oh. on. I had advantage on that and everything. <laughs> uh, you fell down. Oh, what, what fun ice is. Oh, oh wait. He's dead. Oh, no. He's going to explode, isn't he? <laughs> I'm right here. He's going to get all over my doublet. Do I not want to be that close? Or am I fine over here? If I try and move anywhere, the zombie's gonna hit me, so fuck it. Uh, oh, blast, blast the zombie away from hit, yourself. Stab him with your dagger. On my way. Uh, hi ho, Silver, away! <laughs> Hey, that's my nickname. Should get started. He didn't explode. Yet. He didn't explode yet. Bunch of booze and alchemical ingredients. Right. Cancel that. Never wanted the easy path. Rat bat. Rat. There it is. The rat bat bats rats. Send those to camp. There we go. Uh, attack. Attack rolls against beasts have advantage. Plus, it's a plus one two-handed great club. It's just amusing. It's called rat bat. Let's move. No traps, please. It might be useful. So, when is he due to explode? 
No, he's not. I was taking the piss, man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, or was he? I just saw something about a trap disarm toolkit. Apparently, I can't reach it, so. <laughs> oh, it's on a high shelf. Apparently. I'm just reading the naughty book, don't worry. You're reading Play Playboy again, yeah? Alright, have we found anything else good? Cursed to put my hands on everything. Got some locks, chests, and a trap. Barred from entry, the following ex customers are unwelcome. Do not let them in, even should they beg. Especially should they beg. Martin Doty, human? Chug and run. Adam Smythe, uh, lascivious. La uh, la lascivious? Behavior? I have no idea. Uh, also known as the pickle incident. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Levitious Ben. Lascivious. Garing, Garing Goth Thorm, she knows what she did. Kevin Ort, Tall Dwarf. Oh my god, not Kevin Hart. <laughs> Tall Dwarf, exceedingly boring. Syrah B, short half elf, vomited on the waiter, purposefully. Unknown elf, <laughs> pale skin, snide mouth, referring to Master Distiller as the poor scene publican. <laughs> Rochelle Clark, oh. halfling, groin punching, Yon Von Don, suspected alias, grotesquely tall, human, underpants on head. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, I love that book. Uh, would anybody like a great club called Punch Drunk Bastard? I mean, we can probably give it to the barbarian. Yeah. Uh, while you are drunk, you had advantage on attack rolls. You also create a blast with each attack, dealing one to four thunder damage for three uh, for three meters. Oh. But the important thing is he has to remain drunk to effectively use that. Yeah. yeah. Which, you know, is doable. And also hilarious. Bloody hell. The big book of little drinking games. Pain spree, gather your pack, capture a gnome. One by one, your chums gloat how to best maim the gnome. <laughs> In an alphabet, <laughs> and an alphabetical order starting with A. Come up short, take a drink, last chum standing gets to kill the gnome. <laughs> Fucking racist bastards. <laughs> Example, arrow to the bollocks, break its shins, club its head with the broken shins. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh fuck oh stoned get a stone invade an inn kill everyone there this fill is ten... the orcish book of pub games <laughs> <laughs> fill ten tankards with ale arrange them in a triangle on each side of a table long ways you fool <laughs> or arrange them first and fill th and then fill them I don't care put half your chums at one side half at the other Take turns throwing the stone at the opposite tankards. Get it in, drink it dry. Ten empty cups, your team loses. Winning team gets to yank a single claw of their choice out of the loser's feet. Oh, that's fucking harsh. Deal a drink. Attack a village with your pack. Keep killing till a chum loots a deck of cards. Choose a dealer. I don't care how. Short his tail, ugly his feet, something like that. Chum on their right gets two chances to guess the card on top. And dealer chum says if it's higher or lower. 
Dealer Chum chugs twice if the first try is right and chugs once if the second try is right. If the guest chum fails, they chug the difference between the final guess and the card. If your last guess is a four and the card is a nine, you take five chugs. It's basic <laughs> math mathematics. <laughs> New chum dealer when the last one when the last one falls two guest chums. Last one standing torches the village. Fuck's sake. Right, so who's for some drinking games then? These these all sound oh, awesome. I'm taking that fucking book. That is brilliant. <laughs> oh god. Potion of Invisibility, I'll take that. Potion of Glorious Vaulting, we'll take that. Okay, right, where where, where is everyone wandered off to? Because I'm still in the pub. I'm, I'm uh, in the pub attic, I found a key. I'm just nicking all the dis uh, distiller's materials. Ah. Uh, and I've been reading his research notes on a really vicious poison. Oh. Do we have the ingredients for it? Uh, I've got the ingredients for one, and I've got a, um, a, a the location of a cache that will let me do another one. Oh, nice. Uh, in fact, no, I don't. I need to do Salts of Corpse Rose, which I can't quite do yet. Ah, this is where you were. Okay. Right. Would we like to go hand the guy his notes? Yeah. I think we should have a rest first. Actually, yes, you make a very good point. Okay, long rest it is. <laughs> huh. So, that's what people mean when they talk about butterflies in their stomach. All right, there's not a lot really to do, so I think we just rest up. Right. Um, who's carrying a bunch of camp supplies? No time to rest. Uh, I am honey to my pack camp. Been nicking people's booze. Hmm. Yeah, because we've got 3,597 camp supplies worth. Okay, I wasn't carrying that many. Yeah, exactly. That's what I was thinking. I'm like, um... Also, question. Since the barbarian's just wearing standard Githyanki half plate at the moment, what do we think to giving him hide armor plus two? It's only one AC less, but they get a bon one plus one bonus to dexterity saving throws and checks. And a plus one bonus to initiative rolls. I mean, what's his armor class if he takes the armor off? Goes from 16 to 14. 16 to 14, right. And it goes from 16 to 15, wearing the hide armor instead. Hold on a minute. Oh. 
I was going to say, unless we've got something better for him. So his con bonus is plus three, his dex bonus is plus one. Which gives him a plus four, which is why he's 14. Yeah, that's fine. I have something better for him, hang on. To find my chest. Yeah, just find the right one. one. What AC is the um, hide armor? Let's uh, fifteen. And what is it? Fourteen. Do? Sorry, no, fourteen. Uh, balance gains a plus one bonus to dexterity saving throws and checks, and then ambusher gains a plus one bonus to initiative rolls. Yeah, that's better than anything I've got for him. Okay, we'll keep that on him then. At least things have stayed interesting. Right then, shall we rest up? Might as well. Mm -hmm. Cool. We 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 don't. Go on. There we go. No weird dreams or anything. Good. <laughs> okay, right, I am teleporting back over to Last Light Inn. I also gave him a uh, a flesh melter robe as well. I really thought you were about to say you just given him a flashlight, and I was about to have <laughs> no questions <laughs> at all. No, because if he takes any any melee damage from anyone new, uh, whoever does the melee damage to him takes like fucking. One to four acid damage, so three damage exactly. <laughs> right, give me the spell. <laughs> the air stirs in trepidation. You have the ledger. Her lies, her guilt. Madeline reported her friends to a dark justicia and fled when they were butchered. Well, she flees no more. I will be the conduit for Madeline's spirit, 
I will force her to face trial. And you will be the judge. Make her beg. Make her suffer. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the raven was right. We were fated to meet. Break her, my friend. Most thoroughly. As long as I get the spell. I just saw a book dropping right in front of my face. <laughs> He's enjoying this too much. You. He said I was going to be punished. That you'd be the judge. But I didn't mean to hurt anyone. didn't mean nothing. That Ben and Mark were just drunk and whining. The Dark Justicia promised she was gonna chat with him. She promised. Oh, come on. Yeah. You didn't see it. Didn't see what the Dark Justicia did. She gave him a dagger each. And told him to press it against their stomachs. On the count of three, to start stabbing, and not stop till she said so. She never said stop. I'd do anything to take it back. Anything. I was going to say, I'm kind of feeling the top option. Yeah, I want to say that. I want to see that, but that is not going to get you your spell. <laughs> oh. oh, I want the spell. Eh. Got it anyway. Nice and easy. But I appreciate the gardens, though, Bod. You're right. I'm a killer. A monster. I should have died instead. <gasps> ah, glorious. <laughs> Look. My hand still shakes. You broke her most thoroughly. Well done. That was fun. <laughs> if you are satisfied, then so am I. You have done well. Her pain and anguish were sublime. I will I'd smile, it. though. Here, for your services, should I find another murderer in need of torment, I shall call upon you. Farewell. Hey, where's my spell? <laughs> He's not giving you a spell. I want my spell. Hmm. He did give me some clubs, though. Hey, Quaff. Hi, Raven. <laughs> huh? It's Quaff the Raven. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Never more. Will it not let me do two at once? No. God damn it.
Hi, Karma. Yeah, so that guy was meant to give me a spell to be able to fucking torment dead people. So I, I'm a warlock, I want the spell, but he didn't fucking give it to me. Oh, it's fine, we'll find him again. Kill him next time for not giving me the spell. Okay. Right. Uh, so the only thing we've actually got left is Moonrise Towers. Well, have we not still got a bunch of places to go in town? Uh, not really. I mean, we've done the Mason Guild. We've done the House of Healing. There's a little area to the left of uh, House of Healing, which we haven't done just yet. Yeah. And so, Pathways um... over there. Oh, we do have a cache as well uh, for the Bruzar Chemical Stash. Just north of uh, the Baldur's Gate. One. Uh, yes, that's one of the things that I unlocked. Okay, right. I'm teleporting to Baldur's Gate. Then. And we've got the... Um, thing just not uh, the Grand Mausoleum to do as well. Oh, yes, yes, we do. But that, that is a post going to Moonrose Towers thing. Is it? I don't believe so. We'll get a quest. No, I did it before. Okay, well, I mean, you can, but. I'll take that. Mushrooms! Just be careful you don't fill your pack up too full again. Me? Pack? Fill my pack? Yeah. Never. You'll end up leaving I... yourself without much room. <laughs> Shadow Cursed Dwarf. Oh, we've already done these guys, that's why. That's ah, the there's house. the dirt mound. Okay. There's your stuff. Stuff. There. there you go, Max. Make the poison. I like, I like things. Okay, right. So. Did we go in the morgue? Yes, we've done the morgue, haven't we? No, we've done the morgue. More treasure. Greater elixir of arcane cultivation. Gain an additional level two spell slot. Replaces. Oh, okay. Yeah, handy. Well, I I don't think I can actually gain any more spell slots. Oh, so. um, have oh you, you can. Have you looked to the west? Yeah, I am actually looking over that way at the moment. Um, there's a, there's a camp there. Yeah, that looks fairly spicy. It does. And I don't... Tell you what, I'm, I'm quickly going to have a look up here, because I don't think there's much. An assassin short sword. Okay. Yeah, I didn't think there was much around here. I just wanted to double check, though. Okay, fair enough. Oh, Bob's found another cache. Yeah, oh. it seems to be some more um, alchemical supplies. Ooh. Uh -huh. Okay, so we've got this area sorted. Obviously, we've still got to do the Grand Mausoleum, which uh, our good friend Raphael wanted us to do. There is an area to the right of Moonrise Towers, and then, yeah, there's also that way for Baldur's Gates. Yeah, so we can't go to Baldur's Gate before we've done Moonrise Towers. That that we just can't do. No. Clustered fires and tents. The Absolute's army is camped here. Better not press my luck. Oh, so that's the Absolute's army. Okay, good to know. The Mason's Guild seems to have been the centre of the Salunite resistance in the area. We should seek it out and investigate further. There's another thing we should look at. 
because we're not uh, going to invest in Mason Skill. Yes, we have. We found a saloon like thing underneath. Oh, we did, didn't we? Right, we're fine. Yes. Right, we've already done here as well. So yeah, I mean, the only other thing that we haven't explored is just outside, just to the right of the Toll House, and then south of the Toll House. There's a couple of extra paths. Well, that would be a teleport to Reesbin Town then, wouldn't it? Uh, Yes. And yeah, there's a look, there's a bridge over here. Ooh, dead Githyanki. What's in here? And of Githyanki. Lots of dead people. Holy crap. Letter of Surrender. It is with a heavy heart that I must announce the surrender of the harbour forces and its allies to your dark Justicia army under a unanimous agreement. So it is written, so let's be done. Okay, two words are slashed across the bottom of the scroll. Surrender declined. Oof. That's a survival check on me. That's probably another dig point. Probably. I'm coming. There it is. Some tap in the scroll. <clears throat> the scroll was going to mine then. Gloom Strand Shield. Stealth plus one. Anything good in that one? Uh, healing potion. A heavy chest over there as well. Oh, yeah. Potion of animal speaking and some money. Nice. And that's his uh, done with that bit. Yep, just an area down here now. The armor class on the Gloom Strand Shield. Uh, I will let you know as soon as we get back to camp. <laughs> I already sent it to camp. No. Oh. Sorry, I know most of us don't run shields, so. <laughs> Half of us are running shields. <laughs> oh. Sorry. Uh, tell you what, give me a sec. Nope. Nope. Spoiled treacle tart? No, thank you. Okay, right, I'm just going to quickly pop back to camp so I can double check that shield. Uh, it's a plus two to armor glass and plus one stealth. Eh, no, no better than what I've got. What about yourself, Max? I'm running a shield from uh, from Grimforge, so I'm good. Ah, okay. Cool. Right. Leave camp. Okay. That's just another way into Moonrise Towers. Which way would we like to go? Via the main path or uh, this little side entrance? Can you manage the jump? I should be able to. We've got potions to fly if you can't. Ah, 
Oh, I got it. We're good. True soul. A pleasure. What news from the field? To greet those of our like, and weed out those who walk where they do not belong. Zarel's in the audience chamber, true soul. Go right ahead. Yay, free entry. Praise the absolute. Okay, no stealing around here then. God damn it. It's fine, we'll do it later. I was gonna say, unless we can just, you know, kill everyone. Ooh, who's this guy? Anything fun down here? Doesn't look like it. What's back here? What's back here? It's, it's, just, a, it's just a guy secure. wandering around in a massive hat with death ward up. And a very secure barrel. A very secure barrel? Oh, oh so I see. Right. Yes. Mm. I will take care of that later. The Zentarium shipping crate. I wonder what that right. contains. Maybe, maybe we can blag this guy into letting us have it. The Acolytes? Stop. I'm afraid you missed the ship through soon. But there'll be another along I, I've up. made the error of having Only a conversation with somebody. Nothing uh. Just supplies for the battle ahead. I've already checked it twice over. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Oh, it's a two. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, steelithid powers are uh, hard to fail. Your mind lurches, reeling suddenly as if bitten. As you bear down on his mind, you feel a pulse in response. Thousand pulses echoing from the nearby crates. Tadpoles. Oh. His mind had rejected the knowledge, forced it behind a mental wall. A wall you just <laughs> took a hammer to. Oh, the worms. Worms in their heads. <laughs> worms all over. <laughs> Parasites. Worms. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> You'd best wash them off. <laughs> there we go. Perish to the cavern. Nice. What in the hell? <laughs> what in the hell? <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> I'm going to talk to my right and see if I can talk him into jumping in the water. <laughs> Hello, Adet Bell. Busy, or they'll set you lifting too. No. Nope. He's boring. Right, there's no one to. Oh. oh. I'll, I'll distract this guard the other way. It's one that they cried. Can't risk being in open view. There's nothing in the crate. There's an entire shipping crate, I think, means. Oh. Squirms and feels yeah, keep him distracted. I'm doing it. I got caught. Oh. <laughs> I was talking to him. How dare he? Um. I don't know if you guys can listen in on mine. I am doing. Uh, my intelligence isn't exactly great, so. Yeah, but it's a tadpole conversation. It'll be fine. Oh, okay. Ooh, you say that. Well. I'm not going to put on my dark one's own. Look, it's on. You oh. really should use that more because you just don't. You, you save it so often, you never use it. Eh, I have inspiration. There we go. There we go. Twenty-six. We're okay this time. A pattern of blank minds, newly born. They carry only a bare shred of memory, inherited from something older, a sleep of centuries. The 
birth and destruction of a settlement above forming only background noise to the dream until something descended down into the darkness and the dreamer awoke. We, we okay. should definitely steal, steal the tadpoles and put them in our brains. Does it even work to let us do that? Hang on. Better be cautious. Okay. It is stolen, but I am encumbered, so... Yeah, probably hand it off to the muscles. Or to camp. Yes. Also an option. Uh, I was going to say, it has just been sent to camp. I learnt my lesson from the goddamn idol. <laughs> Theft has been reported, and what? it seems you're the only suspect. Choose your next step wisely. I think clearly innocent. So, my choice is either pay or attack. Oh, pay him then. You offer a generous sum, but gold cannot help ah. you. Ah, no. For the cells. Uh, we, uh, go to prison. It'll be fine. Yeah, we'll push you out. Uh... There can be no doubt. This is the place. This is where we're going oh, to Right, because something's been stolen and I'm still nearby and they've... <laughs> Uh, for God's sake. <laughs> We're all going to jail. Well, I'm going to try and talk my way out of this situation. <laughs> I didn't have the option. It's fine. <laughs> what path lies before Whoever the thief is, it clearly isn't you. <laughs> Not me. I'm just getting the hell out of here. <laughs> uh, all of all all of my items and gold and everything got stolen. So this is the place. This is where we'll discover. The well, we're in Moonrise Towers. Moonrise Towers prison. Let's find where you are. Oh, there's plenty of blood. And not unfortunately, there's no simple way of breaking out of these, so... Right, so you've done a prison break before, yeah? Uh, not from this one. Uh, no, I mean, in general. You should know the system yes. behind it. Right, yeah, so you know you've got to just go, like, ten rounds unobserved after you've broken out and you lose the fugitive status. Hi! Hi! A new neighbor. <laughs> ah, well, if you're locked up in here, you must be doing something right. Not surprised. Ooh. The egos Two fresh around here pulse. are made of bloody glass. Can I at least make use of one of them? <laughs> Consider I don't have any. <laughs> oh. I'd bet my last copper that's your ticket out. It's not without risk, but you know the same can be said for all great causes. I have a plan that will make all of talk to the warden. Rue the day they met us. We need tools. That head case of a warden robbed ours, but anything that breaks rock will do. Even if it's not iron hand quality. Help me, and we'll stick it to the absolute. Hey, okay. ooh. Together. Determined. Good. We'll need it. Now, go before the guards see. Um. If, if, if I die, uh, tell Jess I love her. What are you doing? Another Escaping. I'm, I'm about to open the doors for you, mate. Just chill. <laughs> uh, too late. Ooh. We have another parasite. Okay, right. Mm. 
Right. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna take the concentration blast. And I'll take the psionic backlash. Right, that's leaving us with one available. Actually, or do you mind if we use one more to get the favorable beginnings as well? Yeah, go for it. Cool. All right, thank you very much, lads. Right, so, Bod. Mm hmm. If I distract the warden. Yep. An right beneath the um, could you then the pull the cell place. levers and not the alarm That's lever, please? The <laughs> are from. Right. Okay, so we've got there's five cell levers and the communal cell lever. Yeah, the communal cell lever, the big one, sets the alarm off. Okay. Hold on, she's not distracted yet. I'm in a very, very creepy area, I will admit. She is very much ignoring your violin playing. What's inside? She really is, isn't she? Right, are you slowly but surely busting your way out anyway? Yes. We're, we're going to need to deal with this place anyway at some point. Yeah, I am, I am making my way out very slowly. Because, obviously, I do need to get back to get all of my items anyway, so... Well, I might be able to help you with that. Did you already take everything? Not not yet, but I might be about to. Okay. Look, oh, horror. Oh, wonderful. Oh, there's a scry now, Bob. I can't do anything about it until that's gone. Is that blood? No, never mind. On my way. Alright, apparently there's a hook horror around, so do you guys mind if I save real quick? I right, go for it. Yeah, Ugh. almost got spotted. I mean, I know I've got my spells and stuff, but I'd rather not if I can avoid it. Oh, nope. Okay, I'm fighting two Hokoras down here. Okay. Oh, great. And the Barbarian also does not have any of his weapons. So... This is uh, gonna be fun. Shit, I've just. She's following you up the ladder. <laughs> I can then pull How about a little something to smooth things over? 65,310 gold. <laughs> Ow. I'm prone. God damn it. Yeah, I I would probably say don't worry too much about it because I might end up dead. So. It's fine. I just blagged the... Yeah, I forgot to be in stealth. <laughs> ah. That makes sense. Yeah, I, I am also apparently not supposed to be here, so I'm going to try and make this card back the fuck down. God, when the barbarian's casting spells, you know it's really in the shit downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> Mate. Quite literally, I am fucking prone at the moment and can't do shit. I'm on, you know, fucking 7 HP right now. It's two hook horrors at level 4. There I am, I'm down. 
Oh, because I've got no weapons, start. it's it's difficult, so. Oh. oh, slow down on the click, buddy. I could have given you a boost there. Nope. I mean, this is going to end up being a fight. Eventually. Hello, oh, Adam Prison. I want to fight him. Do you mind if I fight him? I mean, I think we might be reloading this anyway because it sounds like our friends downstairs are dead. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I'm, I'm doing my best. It's not exactly going smoothly. Because I'm unarmed. I wanted to sneak, but the loot goblin in me, you know, got the better of me. <laughs> How are you down there? Uh, I don't there's, know. There's a hole in the cell. Oh, that you yeah. have to jump down because you cannot open the gates. There is no way of, of doing anything to them. Well, the, the way of opening the gates is in the tower that we're in. Ah. Uh. Ow. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to make ice there. <laughs> Oops. That's my face. <laughs> and sadly, initiative rolls means that I keep fucking dying. <laughs> yep, I, I am both dead. <laughs> yep, I, I'm I'm dead, dead. So unfortunately, the one the uh, orb downstairs has called reinforcements. I said we'll hold them off up here. It'll be fine. Sorry, it's calling reinforcements. Oh, wow! If I can get to that balcony, I might be able to shoot it out before it manages. Or. Oh, I just haven't quite got a line of sight on that. AOEs I can hit it with. Dead. Sweet. You handle downstairs, I'll take upstairs. Yep. Or, <laughs> or on the other hand. Are you guys in a fight at the minute? Oh, we have a, yeah. Yeah, I, I can't actually properly tell. I don't see what you're fighting or anything, so I just see you two. That was absolutely shocking damage for a level 3 Divine Smite. How many guys are you fighting? Uh, two, but they're reasonably chewy. Yeah, 
Yeah, she's got quite good armor class. That works then. <laughs> Wait, did that not heal you? Um, arrow of... Did you just back up? Oh, you swine! <laughs> what a dick! <laughs> <laughs> it literally just looks like you're being smacked by thin air at the moment. <laughs> oh, that narrows that down a bit. I'm wondering if I'm missing it on XP because of being dead at the moment. You shouldn't be. Uh oh. Hey. Oh. Oh, he's down. Oh, bugger. Damn it. God damn it. <laughs> Fell on my own eyes. Ow. Ow. Yay, orc power. So now you're only dealing with one. It was also paralyzed. Ah, where that's. Nice. I need some snowshoes or something. <laughs> right, I have unlocked the box that's got all of your kit in it. Thank you. Now, could you maybe come and find me? I'm currently oh, there, nice. wherever there is. It's directly beneath us. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, we've also got to uh, recover Will's dad as well. Uh, yeah, we always uh, asking after him, and he doesn't seem to be here. Hmm. All the other people we're looking for are they? Yeah, Will's dad is up north of where I am at the moment, so. Ooh, another locked chest down here. Sorted. 
Right, now we need to go and find. Oh, we'll just open that. Yep, I've got the key. It's a short rest, might be in order. I can. Uh, I was going to say, I can at least short rest us, I know that much. <laughs> Right, now how do we get down to those mooks? Uh, jump. Or down that hole? Yep. Yep. I, I, I have no idea. I, 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 don't I, I don't know if it is. I mean, if I... I mean... I, 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 I don't want to jump know. down the weird blood hole. <laughs> Just yeah, the weird, the weird blood hole does not sound like a good time. Oh, whereas the massive fucking hole in your um, cell... I mean, yes, that's also an option if you if you can find that. Uh, that is. I, I'm stood next to it. Oh. Yes, just jump down there. You won't get hurt. <laughs> really? Yeah, I didn't. I didn't take any damage. Fine. Oh, nice. I've already looted everyone around there, so. <laughs> now we just need to find you. I'm up north, but be careful, there are two hook horrors right by me, so. Yeah, be right. Oh. I'll say north, but I'm Well, I see um, the guy who was supposed to rescue is dead. Who? Oh, oh, oh yeah, he, he's well dead. Uh, what the hell is going on with that? This dude. Um, yeah, all of a sudden, why are bodies down there? There's something on the other side. No way through from here, though. Um, well, all, of the prison... all of the you prisoners have all... been thrown down there. <laughs> What's going on? I thought we rescued them. I thought we weren't rescued them. I mean, we can reload. Yeah. Yeah, because last when I was in the prison cell, Dennis was in the cell next to me, and so was Wolbrun. I even have a quest as well to help Wolbrun break out. Right, I found them, and there are some hot cars, are there? Yes, two of them. It's what killed me, because again, you know, no weapons. Oh, I see you. He still made two. Fine. Let's do the thing. <sighs> yeah, the other one's a long way off. I can at least see what you're fighting down here now. Oh, crit miss. God damn. Off to a good start. Yeah. Mm. Oh, there's one up there. Fine. I think I may just have to blow a level 4 on a highly upcasted spiritual weapon. Where's the other one? On its way in. Nice hit.
Uh oh. Uh, <laughs> fuck's sake. Uh, do I need to, to deal with this me creating ice all the time thing? Is it causing a problem? Um, yeah, well, I think we might be able to get murdered because of it, so yeah. <laughs> Finish the wall of ten hits off. Well, oh, that helps too. Let's, let's try me other one. I now can't melee attack that. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I saved against it when I took it, you know, when I damaged him. Oh, nice. mm. Trying not to fall this time. Oh my god, bod. Yeah, I've got to sort out this ice situation. Yes, you do. <laughs> or just not ballet things, but... That is also an option. Not sure Compel Drill was a great plan. I'm sure I've got better armor class than you. Uh, you do, but you're currently prone, so you get paggered to shit. That's also true. <laughs> now you can see why I struggled so much. <laughs> I make the thirty percent disadvantaged roll with the fucking <laughs> offhand crossbow. There we go. And to be fair, whilst you do have a better AC, objectively, it's 21 to my 19. Yeah. Right, fair enough. Feel free to get hit a lot. To be fair, you are, you are an actual martial class, so... I am now, yeah. Right, let me work out what's causing these ice issues. <laughs> I'll work on resurrecting this, these nublets, then, shall I? Yes, please. I mean, to be fair, think... it, it, it was because I did steal the shit, so, and I, normally, I'd have had an option to, you know, talk my way out of it, but I didn't, and that really actually annoyed me. Well, it seems like every, I shouldn't be doing anything particularly to make ice, just doing cold damage is freezing things. I think it might be because we're in a lot of damp conditions with a lot of water. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Right, do we want to arm you two before we start running around anymore? <laughs> no, I think I'm just going to run off. I've just sent the Barbarian a longsword. It's just a shitty normal longsword, but it's a sword. <laughs> I was going to say, I don't necessarily need arming, so... Is... But that, that was a very he... badly failed prison break all round, wasn't it? Yeah, it wasn't, wasn't, wasn't exactly our... Uh, uh, he's not proficient in heavy armour, sadly, so... With haste. I mean, if I hadn't come across a hook horrors, I honestly think I'd have been fine, but no. I think that's going to be an exit, isn't it? That's the exit, it is. yeah. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah. Ah, 
place might never oh. wash out. Alright, what's behind box number five? Harlequin, black and white dye, and some money. I need someone to try and make a survival roll near me. Yeah, man. <laughs> that one. That'll be the one. That was not worth much. Is that the stat you actually had to do a quest or something to... Oh, yeah, that was like passing rolls to get access to a secret stash in the bottom of Moonrise Towers, and it was like 35 gold. A wall. We'll see about that. Yeah, I believe that was the gnome's planned jailbreak option, but yep. apparently somebody took them on a far better plan that ended them dying horribly. I wonder who did that. Right, which way is it to my stuff? Uh, over here by us. Seems simple enough. So if you go up this good. ladder, there's a uh, there's four chests at the top. It's in one of them. Okay. Uh, um, um, what? That guy just ran. Pulled the alarm and then ran off again. Okay. <laughs> oh, God, I'm absolutely stuck. Oh, in no. Room. Here we fucking go. Get your gear, boys. Do it quick. <laughs> right, I do have it. I've got a cunning plan. Oh, no. Oh, we're all right. They've, they've buggered off. <laughs> oh, with the smoke. <laughs> Let's just shut all the doors for now. They've, they've run downstairs. To get more guards. What? The what? hell is that voice? Are you guys hearing things? Yeah. Oh, no, that's the, probably the fairy in the moon lantern that you just picked up. Oh, yeah, uh... it could be. I did just equip it, so. <laughs> oh, God. I, I have absolutely everything. Yeah, um, should we take a, a quick break while he sorts himself out, bud? Uh, yes, plan. please. <laughs> yeah, mate. Okay. Right, I'm still over encumbered to shit.
Okay. Now I'm looking better. That fairy won't shut up, will it? Or is that just me hearing it? I think it's just you, because I'm not hearing it. Stay crouched forever. I'm hearing it. Oh. No one just heard it. Yeah, he's definitely pulled the alarm thing. Because it's not usable now. Hmm. Are we going to get attacked as soon as we leave here? I'm I'm down to just my first level spell slots. So Would you like a long rest then? Sounds like a plan. I am also absolutely soaked in gore. Won't you help me? Set me free. I mean it's a lock. Right. Okay. So I'm gonna set us for a long rest. Okay. That's gonna get really annoying really fast. Uh, because we didn't hear that before. Oh God! What does Gal want? Un Unequip the moon lantern. We don't need it in here. In which case, then? Where were my other weapons? Ah, yes. That's the one I was using. I'm too still nattering on. Well, it's in my... Oh. Uh, uh, just set her free. I mean... She's doing the thing. If if you're annoying enough, people will do what you want. That is true. Uh, Gail's mirror image. What? Oh, I'm going to talk to Gail. Has he got an exclamation mark over his head for you? He does. Yes, he? Okay. Waterdeep. He wishes to extend you an invitation for a private conversation in a more suitable locale. Um. I'd have thought this would have been more for you. Unless, were you, are you guys not seeing him right in front of us? Yeah, I can see it. Yeah, you go for it. Okay. Gladly. Simply follow yonder path, and soon you will find him. Where? Oh my, oh my. Well, I, I don't think there's anyone else we've got to talk to, is there, so... There you go. Oh my, what will Shadowheart think? Glow. There's an almost reverent silence that accompanies the peak of darkness. When you'd almost believe the dawn will never break. The cradle of eternity. The timelessness of lovers. Um. The most beautiful of fantasies. Don't look at me that way. Hmm. I wanted to see you. 
I still could. <laughs> the way my face dropped then. Alive, I wanted it to be under a canopy of beauty and wonder. I thought this place might bring me peace. I thought it might make the weight of what I must do feel a little lighter. But I'm not so sure. So is that the Aurora Borealis? At this uh, latitude? This... And, and yeah, totally exactly. find to Gale's secret pulling spot. Babe or crone, coward or hero, death is assured. Mistra's forgiveness is not. If you knew the end was near, would you not want to ensure it had meaning? I am terrified. I will not claim otherwise. My face could scarcely conceal it, even if my words sought to deny it. There is no point in running from the inevitable. Better to meet it on my own terms. Your words are those of a dear friend, or a lover, even. Um, no, no, this is no, 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 we will leave the world a better place than it is tonight. Oh, we're not even going to give him a sympathy handy. Nope. <laughs> Mate, I, I know that I'm short, but I don't think it would look even that big in my hands. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> oh, some other shenanigans. No? no, just a weird camera angle. Yep. <laughs> Won't you help me? Dog wags his tail, a small bag clenched between his teeth. Give me stuff. He gives in and surrenders his fine. Teeth. Oh, let it go. It's so annoying. His tongue I'm trying to let it go. I can't his see. Tail wagging even faster. Yeah. What's that? Uh, I've taken the moon lantern. I'm seeing if I can deal with it. Won't you help me? Don't set me free. Apparently, Gal wants to speak again. What people mean. Okay, so Shadowheart's not annoyed at me for talking to Gale. That's right. fine. It's, it's, it's in my camp stash now. <laughs> <laughs> we're not freeing you, we're just putting you somewhere bloody quiet. I was hoping to speak to you, as a matter of fact, about the night you were kind enough to keep this melancholy wizard company. I wanted to... to thank you. I was sinking into a dark place. But you reminded me there is still light in the world. If I should care to look for it. And she talked to Bod, he was trying to sink into a dark place. You may well have prevented <laughs> me from doing something very rash in the near future. I count myself lucky to call you a friend. I just don't want to be collateral damage. <laughs> hmm, careful. I may just take you up on that. Nope, I don't care. Shut up. <laughs> right, I'm going to go pee real quick before we uh, continue our escapades. So, be right back. Hey, folks. We've got an ad break coming up. Go get a drink or snacks and we'll be right back.
Yeah I know. I can't believe how beautiful our chat is today either. They're all absolutely stunning. Wonder if any of them like me. Oh shit is my microphone on. Oh, okay. Are we having a good chat with Halsey? It's true, and yeah. I can't imagine I helped with that. Sometimes I let the task at hand consume me, and people think I'm obsessed. I am? <laughs> Trust me, it's been said. You show more restraint than most in avoiding the subject until now. Mm -hmm. Who's to say? Perhaps there's a half-orc buried somewhere in my ancestry. Or perhaps not. Sometimes I think conventional wisdom is too narrow about what someone can or cannot be. Stranger things have most certainly happened. Hmm. I had a friend when I was young, long ago. He played with me in the forests where I grew up. You're not a doppelganger, are you? Trying to study me to learn all my secrets so you can take my place? <laughs> Save for me. My line perished a long time ago. They rest in High Forest now, near the shade of the grandfather tree. The grove became my family, with Sylvanus as my teacher. And now I have you. It was a long time ago. The wounds don't heal, but they become more bearable. I'm 350 years old. Of course there have been lovers. Just because I love nature doesn't mean I'm betrothed to it. Though sometimes <coughs> nature needs reminding. <laughs> right now, I bed down alone, I'm afraid. Perhaps once I talk less of curses and parasites, my fortunes will improve. Well, uh, <laughs> I didn't pick this scar up in battle. I was in wild shape. Only I forgot it was the season when bears are particularly social. A she-bear claimed me as her own and did not appreciate being spurned. <laughs> Jesus. Hmm. I suppose you wouldn't be shocked to learn I love animals and nature. <laughs> I, I know, I know. Well-trodden territory. Uh, well then, let's see. Um, I whittle in my spare time, and I've something of a sweet tooth. Although everyone's very amused when I say I like honey. <laughs> Ornaments, utensils, <laughs> and ducks. <laughs> and I ducks. Like ducks. Sometimes I think people look at me and imagine my feelings can't be hurt. <laughs> Thank me by returning the favor, why don't you? <laughs> Come on. I'm sure you've something better than carving wooden ducks. Well, they are fierce creatures from what I understand. But as long as you avoid the high seas, I think you can consider yourself safe. Any time. Honestly, I never thought I'd make it that far. But the You know, I've been catching myself smiling more lately. 
think that's your fault. Fine. What's on your mind? Quite splendidly, to give credit where it's due. You and I have shared some good times together, and it seems we have plenty in common. Considering all we've been through, I think I was very lucky to find such favorable company. And attractive company, too, no less. Very serious of you. But go ahead. Well, I'd be lying if I said I hadn't been dwelling. But don't worry. I still have plenty. Druids and Harpers joined together to put a stop to Ketherick Thorn. We marched on Moonrise and, after much fighting, we prevailed. Even in defeat, though, Ketherick turned to Shah. Not long after we sealed him away in his tomb, the Shadow Curse took hold. No one had seen the likes of it before. No one knew how to react. Then it started to claim all those within its reach. Those who had survived the battles now fell to the shadows. Became. You're right. But the work is not yet done. Not while Ketherick Thorn still draws breath. There we go. Okay. Right. Leaving camp. Right, shall we see what cluster fox on the other side of this door? <laughs> Lads. Sounds like a good idea to me. Bandai! Hello, it's crying out. It seems unbothered by our presence. Have we got away with it <laughs> somehow? I think somehow we've got away with this. I think it was not leaving witnesses. Yeah. Apart from that dude who walked in, pulled the alarm and walked out okay. <laughs> yeah, but he, he didn't see us commit any crimes. He just saw a bunch of true stalls standing around going, doo -doo -doo. I mean, what's through this door with all the blood trail? That's got to be worth a look, right? That's got to be worth a look. <laughs> Marching gnomes. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Sneaky little gnome. <laughs> Come steal this girl to speak with Dad. I don't want that. No, I'm gonna take it anyway. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, that one is worth having. Oh my god, that tickled me. Did you just steal it from my inventory? Did you? No. No, no. You'd never do that to me, would you? Oh, I'd, I'd honestly beat you over the head and take it from your corpse. <laughs> oh, right. Th those doors lead us there. We lead us follow away. this blood trail. <laughs> Back out in the docks. Ah. Or we can go up inside the tower. I wonder if they're waiting to mug us at the top of the stairs. Let's find out. Uh, my game's a little bit broken. There we go. I had to right click to be able to interact with anything. There's a trader. There's a blood trail. If we're not following this blood trail, what are we even doing? Hold on. Uh, I was going to say, sell shit. Yeah. Uh -huh. There's two traders. If you have coin, then show it. Oh my god, this one's got a moustache. And that's some top notch facial hair. Exactly. I, I should talk to I should talk to him beard to beard. Titan string bow. 
Titan weapon. This weapon deals additional damage equal to your strength modifier. Yeah, you're still using dex to hit, so it's um, not great for anybody, really. There's plate armor plus one. There's a sentinel shield, heightened awareness, gain a plus three bonus to initiative rolls and advantage on perception and ability checks. Ooh. I think I might have that, if no one else does. That's fine with me. I don't necessarily need it. Uh, well, just hold off before you do anything with that. That's uh, fine. I was mostly just having a look around anyway. Uh, armor of Devotion, which is 18 armor class heavy armor with the Eternal Devotion class action. Uh, recite your oath, regain one channel of charge. Right, that's paladin armor, which I can't wear because I've got heavy armor proficiency. So yeah. that's going to be good to know what. Uh, we've got a breastplate plus one, which is medium armor. Uh, we've got chainmail plus two, which is 18 armor class, and you take two less slashing damage. Chain shirt plus one, chain shirt plus two, half plate plus one for 16 armor class. Uh, a few different hide armors, none as good as the one that he's wearing. Uh, sharpened snare queer ass, medium armor. Add your full dexterity modifier to your armor class. That doesn't help for the barbarian, and it's worse than my current armor. Plate armor plus one. Uh, a poisoner's robe. Loads of shit. Yeah. Barbarian's carrying three great axe plus one. I don't think we need that many. Right, is it worth us keeping the Githyanki half plate if we're not really going to be using it now? No, I'd start selling them on. Okay. Ooh, um, bod. Yep. I've just realised um, the barbarian is carrying some hoarfrost boots. Uh, you cannot fall prone while traversing icy terrain. Oh, that would be. Um, mm, yeah. Mm, yeah. I could definitely use those. Stop falling over in anywhere vaguely damp. I'll send them to you in just a moment. So those. I could just help myself to them. A ring of spiteful thunder. When the wearer <laughs> deals. Like exactly. When the wearer deals thunder damage to a reverberating creature, it becomes dazed unless it passes a con throw. Right. Have we got anyone who can make things reverberate? I don't know. It's something that'll stack with something else to do vaguely useful things. I don't uh, know. Uh, gloves of crushing, where against plus one bonus to unarmed attack rolls. No, that's not helping. The sparkle. Oh, I've seen what's. Yeah, I've got a ring that actually does an ice circle. Let me take that off. God damn it. Mm -hmm. So I don't need the whole frost boots then in that case. Ooh. Um, I'm buying that. A hand crossbow that does exclusively force damage with a plus one enchantment and <laughs> the magic missile spell. Get yes. in there. That's the, yes. Get moving, will you? Right. Uh, you can talk to that guy now if you want. Oh, wow. 
Bloody wall. Have a taste if you don't believe us. All right, this one's clear. Cool. I'm gonna go speak to them. See if there's anything decent. Ah, a new face come to bask in the light of the absolute. Of course. Just before. Yeah, so that's his own mode of playthrough. I did not get to interact with these traders. Soul. A pity neither of us saw what happened. I believe my opening gambit was a two foot long shaft of wood with feathers on one end and a nice they spiky a bit on the other. frothing at the mouth than faithful, true enough. Here, though, look around. All manner of beasties united against the enemies of the Absolute. Quite a god to bring them all together. Ooh, quite a that's not a bad spellcaster helm there. Fistbreaker helm, plus one to spell save DC and plus one to initiative rolls. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah, I'm considering it, but mine is attackers can't crit and resistance to fire and hunter's mark. So, ew. I'll, I'll have a look in a minute. Yeah. I am so glad I bought this re uh, bought this crossbow. Um, it's a five dart magic missile. Without using a spell slot, once every short rest. Okay. On top of my hand crossbow now doing force damage. That's pretty sweet. This garb might be quite good for the Barbarian. So it'll give him plus two constitution, which is plus one armor class in itself. Oh, yeah. Yeah, my, my current headband is... Um... Yeah, he's better than that because it's my arcane synergy thing. I'm, I'm kind of tempted by it because I do do more spell safety and I can need more initiative as well. Yeah, I might like that. But it won't look as awesome as this, huh? That's <laughs> no. the main problem. An honor, true soul. Right, I'm, I'm done with the Zentarium one. I don't have anything decent for me, so... Not for us. If it's 
I'm going to buy myself that rapier plus two as well. I succeeded on a perception check. Hmm. Don't want me just stealing all the food. Right, what's up here? Something slimy seems to be dripping from the rafters above. Let's see. Yeah. There's, a, uh, there's you another trader in here. Plus two to hit. Araj O'Blood, trader in all things. A very great pleasure to meet you, true soul. Should you be interested, I have a particular offer I'd like to make. Put plainly, I'd like your blood. A vial of true soul's blood, specifically. With one drop, I can brew a rather potent potion for you. The rest, I keep for myself. Research, naturally. We Abloodras are simply curious by nature. You realize why the name rings familiar? How Zablodra was purged a century ago by an alliance of rival drow houses. Among the many crimes tallied against them, their reckless experimentation with illithid breeding stock. Blessed by the absolute, but not blinded by it. Now I simply must study you. The beings you speak of have no use for gods. And yet here we stand in a church of their making. Unless they are not the makers, but simply the means. Wouldn't that be a secret worth knowing? So let me adjust my offer. Your blood and your silence. In exchange for the potions I mention, and a tidy pile of gold besides. Ho oh, ho, okay. I've got a marker that says suspicious sounds and some mucus. I'm gonna... Yeah, that was that was my uh my perception roll. No idea. Did you fiddle with it? it will be I tried. To you. It wouldn't let me do anything. Your blood essence Just as we need to go up above. Intertwined. We right. can learn exactly <laughs> what that means together. Hmm? Just a little prick and it's all over. Close your eyes. A little pain for a lot of gold. And... There we are. All of your very best traits. <laughs> in a bottle. Use it well. And, if I may, would you have a moment to discuss another more personal matter? Truth be told, I heard tell of your coming before you arrived. Ketherick's dogs prowl far and wide round the tower. I know you travel with a delightful Nightwalker in your retinue. Please, I have a proposal for him. I will reward you both. Handsome. A Nightwalker? Oh, okay. I will speak of it when he is here, not before, but it will be to your advantage, I promise. Mm. <laughs> I can now That's blast walls down with my hand crossbow. My <laughs> I'm a friend because it's now doing force damage, which walls are vulnerable to. to okay, um, so I am speaking to someone that wants me to bring... Um, Astarian with me. She wants to speak to him. Yeah, it would it involve kicking someone out of the group? It would. I mean, we can quite literally just tell the barbarian to, you know, stay at the camp for a, a little bit. Um, 
Uh, I'm, I'm less worried about that. I'm more worried about what happens with him, though. <laughs> wow, well, certainly one way to find out. Yeah, I can bring him here. I must prepare myself for his arrival. Oh, it is it is approaching pirate bedtime. BRB. Okay. Elixir of Gnomish Ingenuity. You are proficient in sleight of hand checks and you can cast knock until your next long rest thanks to your crafty wiles of the forgotten folk. The fuck is knock? Knock? Unlock it's a, it's an unlock spell. Oh, yeah. It, un it will unlock any non-magical lock. Ooh, that's handy then. Okay, how much gold did you give me? I don't know. Interesting. I want to see if she offers you the blood as well. Trader in all things occult. A very great pleasure to meet you, true soul. Should you be interested, I have a particular offer. With one drop, I can brew a rather potent potion for you. The rest, I keep for myself. I, I've got a specific paladin. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm just seeing that now. Well, it'll Did you fail a history check, by the way? I haven't made one yet. Oh. Just a little prick, and it's all over. Hey, it's more than a little Close prick. <laughs> a little pain for a lot of gold. And there we are. Uh, I think because I made the history check. In a bottle. We all get extra gold for it as well if we accept it. Elixir of half elven healing. Still alive, so that's progress. On consumption, you and surrounding allies regain hit points equal to your constitution score. So give that to someone who's got a decent no constitution score. We can learn exactly what that means together. Oh, equal to your constitution score, not bonus. A lot of doing. elven elegance. Noble elven blood grants you an additional 10 meters of movement speed, dark vision, and you can't be charmed into your next long rest. Welcome back, true soul. You've come in the spirit of trade, I hope. Now you're trading with her, okay. I was going to have a look at that uh, in a sec. No See if she's got anything good. I'm back. Welcome back. Uh, we've got someone that's uh, further can I go? giving us money and, and nice potions over here. Yeah, I mean, I was kind of thinking of having a chat with this Lynn Seller in the kitchen with her I'll give it a shot. pet nulls. Okay, dominated nulls, I should say, on mouse over. Let's have a look. That's you. Hi. <laughs> uh, <yeah>. Hi. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> you struggling with the door there a bit? Yeah. Right, fine. Uh, Timothy. <laughs> yeah. Barnabas and Timothy. But... A moment, true soul. You use a spoon to stir the soup, Barnabas. Get the axe, my darling. I've shown Barnabas a kinder way. A kinder name is only fitting. That is the gift the Absolute gave me when I stood before her. To rewrite the lives of her faithful. Make them believe there's something better. Good is buried deeper in some, that is true. But she will always find it. Barnabas, sweetie, come show what a good boy you are. Mm hmm. What would you 
would you like him to do? Oh, you'd like that, wouldn't you, Barnabas? You feel her will surge outwards and envelop the creature, inexorable as the tide. Kill her, rip her throat out. Yeah. Do it. Yeah. Yep. Yes. Do it. Do it. I on. I mean. I'm invested yeah. in this. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> in that corpse you should take a look <laughs> all trace of restraint is gone as the symbol glows power courses through you authority oh uh, on what case no i have to fight him i mean you know yeah, I get it. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> the beast Thank God. Sizes you up, then turns away to easier <laughs> prey. The kitchen's rich stock of unguarded meat and a warm patch by the fire. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like that. That's good. I feel I earned that tadpole. <laughs> yeah, you take that one. I need it. Couple of ghouls, I am. There's nothing I really want to take, so if anyone else wants to eat the tadpole, feel free. Uh, sure, I'll take it. I'll have the look of the far realms. Bonus crit damage, because why not? Where do you hail from? Oh, yeah, I need oh, to go speak to the encounter. I'm sorry, guys. You're going to want to listen in today. Uh, okay. The facts suggest otherwise. Oop. You were ordered. Ass! No, no, it was me, Nora. <laughs> she got the orders. She. Enough. No, it's this guy again. A okay. A blast of mental energy washes over you, filling the room. Your tadpole squirms, urging you to obey. You failed to retrieve the artifact. You failed to protect your true soul. You do not deserve to live. Mercy, General! Please! General Thorne? Let our newest arrival speak. <laughs> you have seen what these creatures are capable of, and you have seen their inadequacies. Isn't that so? What is your judgment? You know I'm loyal! Tell him! You were the one swinging the fucking gnome over in the windmill. <laughs> Prick. Lies! I served the absolute. I did everything I was told. No, you did not. And there you have it. 
We are too close to the ending and the new beginning. I can coddle failure no longer. Why is he American? Everyone else is British. Kill them Why is he American? Quickly. What? No! You creaking old bag of shit! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, good girl. Holy shit. Not some very good armor. I'm so sorry, my lord. She's an unbeliever outside my control. Try again. <laughs> I was going to say, yeah, try again. Good swing. Dispose of the rest as you see fit. Or better yet, put that true soul to use. You have far more important matters to attend to. Or have you forgotten? Of course not, my lord. Thank you. <laughs> you heard the general. The goblins are yours. Deal with them however you wish. Here in the seat of the Absolute's power, your authority over them is complete. They will obey any command. Report to me upstairs when you're done. We can keep them as uh, Please, soldiers. You gotta help me! For old time's sake! <laughs> oh, crap! <laughs> you're gonna enjoy this, ain't ya? <laughs> <laughs> the seat of the Absolute's power. Occupied by a general that cannot be killed. But his followers are flesh and blood. Uh, I don't dare you be having a fight without me. Exactly. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize you, it means you took the, uh, took the attack there for me. I just got dragged into it. I just wanted to watch. Yep, there we go. Thank you. <laughs> so say it was not a typical fight, that. I'll take him to take five of my temporary hit points off me. <laughs> Alright, did she have anything decent? Welcome back, true soul. You've come in the spirit of trade, I heard. Ooh. Yeah, you know, I've got to admit, I'm fairly impressed by that goblin, that goblin's chops. <laughs> Just going, yeah. no, fuck you, I'm going to nick this helmet and throw it through you. Know, like, yeah. You go on, you bad self. I also appreciate the, oh, oh shit, you're going to enjoy this, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> Now, unfortunately, she doesn't have anything decent for myself. I mean, the only thing that I can think of really is that there's the boots of arcane bolstering, but I don't dash very often. No, we're, well, generally, if we're dashing, we've done something wrong. Exactly. 
So Come yeah, back. okay. I'm not I'm not taking anything from her. And yeah, the um, magic missile ability off this um, hand crossbow is pretty spicy. <laughs> <laughs> Have we looted the bodies? Yeah. Okay. Let me just pick the furniture up. There we go. Let's see right, how far I'm going to do a save. Okay. Hello, I'm enjoying this. From this seat, Ketherick defied <laughs> gods and raised an army for the absolute. It is not particularly comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> This is a this is a very different experience than last time I was in here. <laughs> I was knee deep in blood every step. <laughs> yeah, I mean this is disappointing then. Yeah, considering that we've murdered hoboed our way through everything so far, I'm surprised that they're happy with us at the moment. I don't get it. It's because we've murdered hoboed our way through to the point where there's no witnesses. Mm-hmm. I suppose, yeah. Right. Are we happy to uh, head our way up? Yep. Oh. <laughs> Sparks already has. Okay. <laughs> <clears throat> Is there anything up here? No. Okay. Right. I'm going in. Do you want to do the talking on this one? Yeah, go for it. Because, yeah, as we know, I haven't done any of this so General far. General so. prayers and preparations must not be disturbed. The rooftop is off-limits to everyone. Even you, Disciples Rao? Everyone. Keep watch and ensure that nobody passes. Excellent timing, true soul. Uh, sorry, I can't see anything but giant ogre norks. The goblins. <laughs> Tell me how they suffered. No. Better yet. Show me. I mean, I didn't touch them, but... Flickering across your memory can reach them. ...blaze of excitement. Tons of psychic flame lap at the memory of the goblins dying... Oh, the goblins, not the ogre titties. I see you like to handle underlings physically. So do I. <laughs> I was gonna say, yeah. For a while, but I get bored of people awfully quickly. Let's see if you can. Sounds like some of my dating history. She parts the folds of your mind again, touching your wants and hopes, tasting them. Every emotion soaks into her mind's palate. But there is purpose to her exploration. She is searching for proof of your faith. Take it. I, I, I kind of want to go for the shadow heart option, though. Okay, confuse her with filthy sacks. Exactly. Don't go for a ten to thirty bonus. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. 
Whoa, okay. Yeah, I got it. I can handle this. <laughs> you took pity on one of Shah's sorry little followers. Or was it genuine affection? Let's take a closer look. With the absolute, your fantasies can become more real than flesh. The pleasures of the mind can surpass those of the body. I have already been blessed to stand in her presence. It was bliss. She gave me everything I wanted. Hmm. Oh, why not? What's the point in power if you don't get to have a little fun every now and again? She gave me the power to cut the thread of life with a thought. Ooh. I want that. <laughs> but I can caress as well as cut. That's why you should stay on my good side. And the best way to do that is to serve General Thorn. I have a mission for you. That's it. Play along. The closer you can get to the general, the closer you'll be to the answers you seek. <laughs> I mean, I, I normally do have a price. I like gold. Mm, it's not really the infiltrator way of doing things, though, is it? It's not, and that is kind of the way that we've got everything going at the moment, so... Ah, oh, fine. There Do is for a free. That General Thorm requires. He sent his most trusted advisor, Disciple Balthazar, to retrieve it. Balthazar. The relic is beneath the Thorm family mausoleum. That is where you will find oh. Balthazar. But we have lost contact with him. Go there. Aid Balthazar if you can. And bring the relic home. It is something that General Thorm desires. And that he has ordered us to retrieve. That is all you need to know. She's suddenly nervous, on edge. Talking about the relic makes her anxious. Hmm. Ooh. <laughs> that one I'm putting it on for. Yeah, add the spicy bonuses for that one. Yep. Thirty-five. <laughs> Holy shit. I am in awe of the power the relic must hold to be of such importance. General Thorne will not leave Moonrise without it. Death would not silence Balthazar for long. But dead or alive, he is lost. Whatever has become of him, it is the relic that matters. Okay. Fine. Talk to the bugbear quartermaster. Ooh. Tell him he's to share my secret stash with Ooh. you. And I accompanied him. It was destroyed shortly after he left Moonrise. Hardly a surprise. We're protected here, but outside the shadows are hungry. The shadows around the mausoleum are deep and hungry. You will need a moon lantern to survive them. Take one from Balthazar's chambers. But don't pry. <laughs> the last person who snooped into his secrets lost their head. I believe he uses it as a chamber pot. <laughs> okay. Something good here. The stash.
everyone subscribes to what Oops. is mine if I wasn't trying to take it, I just wanted to see what it was. Let's see what's in this secret stash. The disc is formed from slate and engraved with Githyanki writing. It closely resembles the disc that Lacelle deciphered. Ooh, this that might be a nice armor upgrade. Resolve into coherent words and sentences. The story of Orpheus further unfolds. The Prince of the Comet, Part Three. The histories tell us that Commander Voss, Gestil Kithrak, pierced Prince Orpheus clean through with his sword of silver. That his flesh was torn and fed to the great red dragon, Ephelima. Vlacketh's faithful roar out this tale. But beneath the roars, we hear whispers carrying truth and prophecy. The Prince of the Comet is not dead. The Prince of the Comet will come again. The Prince of the Comet will liberate us from Vlacketh's tyranny. Praise be to Mother Gith, Queen of the One Sky. Praise be to your son, Orpheus, the true Who's fighting? Heir. No, Prince it's me pulling the wrong label. The oh. chapter ends there. This disc might be of some interest to Lazelle. Uh-oh. Oh. Now I'm fighting. I was going to say, what the fuck happened? I literally came out of a, a, a conversation piece and... Fight. <laughs> You having fun summoning zombies? I just pulled the wrong, uh, wrong um, switch. Out. I couldn't remember which switch it was. Um, okay. Time to push my luck again. Can't slow down. Stabby stab. <laughs> crit. One hit point left and I crit it, Jesus. Should mind my step. Is there anything nice in that heavy chest? I don't like the fact that I'm having to save against poison clothes right now. I'm working on it. Thank you. Swear to God, bot, I thought you were a giant fucking scrying eye then coming in. <laughs> Huge eyeball. Is everything okay in here? Yes. I'm been exploring his bookshelf. What's that? I'm just not sure which order. Oh. Oh. <sighs> I didn't. Um, yeah. To we those who doubted me, hearts. may the storm claim your final breaths and the earth reject your rest. That's what I was trying to do. <laughs> the necromancer nope. was experimenting on the tadpoles.
have to find it first. I doubt he's just left it lying around. A ritual circle? Looks like it would use in the crafting of moon lanterns. A goblet filled with the mutilated corpses of a lithid parasite. Whatever ungodly experiments were performed on them likely killed them. <laughs> do you want a new hat, Bod? Um, do I? Oh, it sounds potentially interesting. Okay. Yeah, it's a new inventory. And we should be careful about how much further we go because we're allowed in here but not anywhere else. Saving. Because I've just opened a door. Uh, uh, it's not in my inventory. Is it? Oh, I might have sent it to the barbarian man. So I don't want to have it. I'll go over it in his backpack then. Ah, oh, I might have sent it to camp by accident. One sec, I need to go back to camp for some more um, lock picks anyway. Alright. Let's get in and out. If you do manage to get more lock picks, let me know. I've got tons. Good, because there's a metal door over here I could do with unlocking. <laughs> Is it a red metal door? It is. It is. We, we should leave that alone then while we're trying to be stealthy. There's no one out here right now, so. There might be someone behind it, though. Yeah, there might be. Who knows? I mean, the worst case scenario is we have a massive fight. Oh no, no, trim that. What the hell? Wait, Roger. All right, it's about time to skulk about. Hmm. More zombies at the front, yeah. Have you brought the moon lantern back? I take it. Uh, yeah, I went, I brought one back from camp and uh, the one that I nicked from his room. So we've got two now. Okay. One's in your inventory. One's in mine. No wonder I'm hearing it fucking screaming at me again. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I put the one that was screaming in your inventory. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. I thought you would. Won't you help me set me free? Right. I think I need to start wrapping it up there, guys, because I'm getting very tired. Yeah, no, that's fine. Not a problem. Um, if we want, since we know that we need to go to the mausoleum, uh, would we like to teleport over there and then save? Sure. Yep. Uh, Won't you help me? Set me free. Right. Good night, folks. Night, mate. Sleep well. Oh, right. Quick save done. Right then, bud, I will catch you next week.
But good game, yeah. See you next week. Bye. Right then, folks. That is me near done for the night. Hope you all enjoyed the stream. Hope you had fun. Hope you enjoyed yourself. Uh, next stream is currently planned for... What day are we on today? We're on the 10th. Uh, next stream is planned for next Wednesday uh, with more Baldur's Gate. And then after that will be the birthday stream. So, for now guys, enjoy the rest of your evening. And I will catch you all soon. Bye-bye.